And as we've mentioned, San Diego's mayoral election is getting national and international attention. If David Alvarez prevails in tomorrow's runoff election, it'll be a historic day for the city of San Diego. Our Susana Franco explains. On the eve of election day for David Alvarez, campaigning started early at 6 o'clock in the morning on the San Diego trolley. We're spending our day today talking to voters throughout the neighborhoods of San Diego. With recent polls showing Alvarez and Kevin Faulkner neck and neck, Alvarez and his supporters know a lot is at stake. He stands for Latinos, African Americans, Asian communities, Native American communities, working class folks. Christian Zamirez is part of Rising Majority, a political action committee concentrating on reaching out to Alvarez's constituents in southeast communities. It's such an important opportunity for uh, not only Latinos, but I think for all San Diegans to recognize that our city is beautiful, it's diverse, and it needs to be representative of that in city government. South of the 8th, you've seen the Democratic Party make a concentrated effort to get the message to those people that their vote does count. If Alvarez wins in Tuesday's election, he will become the city's first Latino mayor in the city's 164 years. History. This will be national news, and San Diego again will be on the map, but this time for a positive reason. The 33 year old candidate says he understands the historic implications, but even more, it's simply about being a role model. No matter where you come from, no matter what happens to you in life, you can overcome all those obstacles and you can become someone. Experts say it will all come down to getting unlikely voters to the polls. To all San Diegans, the message is the opportunity to make history is here. Uh, you need to go out there and participate in this important process. Susana Franco, San Diego 6 News.